Okay, you guys. Oh, let's do lunch again. KFC Singer. It's a $5 uh, fill-up meal. And... I don't think I've had, ever had a Singer. But let's do lunch and I'll tell you. story, a mix-up I had with her daughter years ago when she was at City College. It's kind of funny. Um, so for the uh, five buck Philip Singer meal, you get soda pop and a cookie for two. Your choice of sides. Uh, I chose coleslaw and a Singer burger. What is this? What is the Singer Burger? Mm. Oh, it's like a piece of fried chicken. Yeah. Mmm. Let's see. Mmm. So the difference between the Singer, the mailbox, and the two pieces of chicken is um, you don't get a biscuit. You don't get a biscuit. Instead, you have a sandwich. Um, it looks like the side is smaller. Uh, I thought the side was a little bit of a larger portion with the two pieces of chicken, but I might be wrong. Anyways, I love their coals up. Um, oh, sidebar, when I was, after I placed my order and I was getting to the drive through window, I saw a sign on the window that says two hot apple pies for a buck forty. I almost did a backflip in the drive seat. <laughs> oh my goodness. So I, in the last second at the window, I got two hot apple pies for a back party, and they were gone before they, we even got home. That's terrible. So anyway, keep your eye open for this. This is a fun little dessert there. Okay, so, um, have you ever had word, um, well, you know, you're talking to somebody and you think you're talking about the same thing, but you, then you find out you're not talking about the same thing. That happened with my daughter about four, five, maybe seven years ago when she was at junior college. The conversation went on for so long that every time I think about it, I can't believe it. Um, um, we were talking about two, it was the same word, but we were talking about two completely different things. It was the store that I never knew even existed. Have you guys heard of that clothing store called Anthropology? Alright. Never heard of the store, never knew anything about it. To this day, I still don't understand why they call a clothing store Anthropology. But anyway. I'm concerned. Anthropology has always been like a stud, a class you learn in college or high school. It's a, you go and call, take a class of anthropology study. Um, at the time, my daughter was here during the summer. She was in the middle of moving from from place to place, and she was taking getting her degree into taking a summer school bunch of classes. So I never know what the classes are. But it's kind of like nearby. All um, city colleges like 
10 miles, 10 or 12 miles from here. And we have a shopping mall right up 7 or 8 miles from here. And then my parents are like 20 miles from here. It's not like one great big circle. So, uh, this one day, a nice summer day, my daughter had class. So, when she's leaving, I said, I'll call you later. I'll figure out the schedule. I'll pick up Grandma. Or we're going to go to Grandma's house, something to that effect. So I call her. And I'm thinking she's at college. And I, I say, where are you at? She says, anthropology. So I think she's at college at her anthropology class. But in reality, she's already at the mall at the anthropology clothing store. I have no clue. So I, I remember, I don't, can't remember the exact questions in order, but I asked about seven or eight questions before I blew my top when I realized we weren't even talking about the same thing. So I said, where are you at? She says, anthropology. So I'm thinking she's still at class. I said, oh, like, when, when are you going to be done with that? <laughs> I should have known this from the very beginning. She said, she's like her dad, easygoing, casual. Uh, um, I'm just a very happy fun person. So I said, well, when are you going to be done with that? Thinking it's the class. She says, I don't know. <laughs> I should have known right then, because the class has a certain beginning and ending time. And so, um, probably not too much longer. Um, okay. And I said, well, uh, I said, well, I, I'm on my way to Grandma. I can just come and pick you up. She said, no, I'm probably going to walk around for a while. And I'll meet you at Grandma's. So I'm still thinking she's at college. So she's going to walk around, maybe get exercise, meet up with friends, and do walking around campus. But still, she's she's think, saying, and she's communicating she's going to walk around the mall. Hmm. Um, I, I said something to her. So... How is anthropology? Do you like it? She said, oh, and she was real positive. And she said, oh, yeah. And something like pretty cool, or it's really neat. And so I got to think, oh, good. Um, so, and I said something like I'm surprised, like, like, oh, my goodness, that's so good you like that. Um, because I bet it's a real interesting... Um, because I think it's probably really interesting for you to yeah, it's really cool. So I still think she's talking about the class. She's still talking about the clothing store. And I said, well, let me call. I said, so you figure out, you walk around, do what you're going to do. I'll still call you because I'm going to leave like in 23 minutes and then I'll still call you in case we're going to go to Grandma's together. She said, okay. Um, mm hmm I'll be ready to call her black back later. Um, um, so she decides, I'm uh, ready to go. She says, yeah, you can pick me up. Now, where exactly is the anthropology? What building? Because I had an idea of math, arts, and sciences. I kind of had an idea of the campus. So, so what building is it in? <laughs> the mall. Oh, really? They have classes there. So I'm thinking, you know how you can do a college course. You don't have to go to the college. You go, you go somewhere else and study like your university course, but not right on the university campus. But I go, oh. and in the morning, I have classes there. Um, she said, what? And she, 
I says, um, we're at the mall for your class. And she says, what class? I say anthropology. And she was so disgusted. I could hear her voice drop like a hundred tones down like this, really disgusted. She said, are you kidding me, mother? I said, what? She says, do you mean this whole time you thought I'm taking an anthropology class? <laughs> yes. What are you talking about? He goes, I don't even think you're really to even continue this conversation. That's how crazy this conversation has to be. And then she tells me, she's at the mom, anthropology, clothing store at the mall. Then I got really mad. I said, you mean to tell me we've been having a conversation all morning and all the questions I've been asking you? And this whole time you've never been at school taking an anthropology class. <laughs> I have that man. But then, after I did apologize, because I could see how all the questions I asked, unless each of us knew what the other one was talking about, the questions added up. So anyway, lucky for us, I didn't go crazy and laugh hysterically on my video. I like to tell stories, but I don't want to laugh so hard that it ruins the story. I'm, again, I'm starving. I can't believe I'm so starving. Um, this singer is okay. It's a little bit spicy. Honestly, between the two, the zinger and the two pieces of fried chicken, I like the fried chicken one better. But I'm probably going to go back and try another one. I think they have like five or six different filler up box lunches, I think. So anyway, can you pull, has that ever happened to you with your kids? No. Yeah. You are so out of date with the stores that your young adults are shopping at. I ended up in a conversation like that. That crazy. So yeah, she was in her. She was in like her early twenties. Maybe it was ten years ago. When did that store come out? When did that anthropology store come out? Because it had to been new. Because I, I'm not that old. Out of the loop, I don't recognize clothing stores and stuff like that. Again, I'll probably never get the singer again. Coleslaw is delicious. Same old, same old passion KFC recipe. Mm -hmm. Mm. I think I just love the original stuff. chocolate chip cookie. It's a toss-up between theirs and McDonald's. Oh my goodness. Mm. <sighs> this has been so fun. <sighs>